the dual meanings of play ball. Hello everyone and welcome back to our English language learning series. Today, we're diving into a common phrase that can be quite playful and literal in some contexts, yet formal and metaphorical in others. Can you guess it? That's right, we're talking about play ball. Stick around to learn both its meanings and how to use it. The first and most straightforward meaning of play ball is deeply rooted in the sport of baseball. In baseball, the phrase play ball is called out by the umpire to signal the beginning of a game. It's the equivalent of saying, let's start the game. So, when you're watching a baseball game or even playing one, and you hear someone yell, play ball, you can expect the game to start. However, its usage isn't just restricted to baseball. In a broader sense, it can be used informally to indicate the start of any game or playful activity. Imagine kids waiting to start a soccer match in a park. One might shout, play ball, to signal everyone to begin. This is where things get a tad bit more abstract. Outside of the sporting context, play ball can be used metaphorically. When used in this sense, it implies a willingness to cooperate or agree with someone on something. For instance, imagine two businesses negotiating a deal. Once they reach an agreement, one might say, all right, let's play ball. This doesn't mean they want to start a baseball game, but rather, they are ready to move forward and cooperate with the terms they've discussed. Another scenario could be someone seeking compliance or cooperation from another party. They might say, if you play ball with us on this, we'll ensure you get a good deal. Here, it means, if you cooperate with us. So, there we have it. Play ball can either be a signal to start a playful game or an indication of readiness to cooperate in a formal situation. It's fascinating how the English language has phrases that can have such varied meanings, isn't it? We hope you found this video enlightening. Remember, context is key when interpreting phrases like this. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you in the next lesson.